Good morning, Tillies. This is your girl, Aqua Till, and this is day negative four, my second day here. And I just wanted to update you guys and let you guys know what was going on. And I'll put the little pictures of what I ate yesterday up. The couple I did take, I had my soup. I didn't really like it. I added a little salt and pepper, and it helped me cope it down. But it was a little portion, so it wasn't too bad. But um, this morning, all I was able to do was get up, brush my teeth. Right now, they have my chemo going, so I'll be able to get up and get in the shower and do my bathroom routine once my chemo's done. They gave me my morning meds, and it was too late last night and too early to take a picture of my night meds and my morning meds, because I still be tired. But hopefully today I'll be able to get those pictures in so you guys can see how many pills and stuff I take and the medicine they give me before I take my chemo. But right now, this is day, technically day three, and I was able to do my juicing for the full first day, but last night they kind of told me like, okay, your levels are too low. You won't be able to continue with continue with your uh, detox or whatever. So I did wake up this morning and it was like, well, what kind of cereals you guys got? And I was going to drink that with almond milk. But since I can't eat any fresh fruits and veggies, so I really don't know what I want to do yet. Uh, I might just eat cereal this morning. And try to figure out for the next mornings like what's best off the menu that will help with my diet because everything has to be cooked and stuff like that if it didn't come out the package so that's a little bummer on that hopefully once my levels do go back i'll be able to start back my juicing and all that i'm not gonna eat meat they want me to eat meat if you re uh, listen to my watch my first two videos you'll understand why and what but that's not what i want to do i'm sorry my lips all dry mouth dry once I get up and go do my morning routine, then I'll be a little shinier. Lips won't be so dry. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put in what I had last night. And hopefully, oh, another update. I have to wait to do my yoga because they don't have any mats for me. They have these big black mats that they use on the sixth floor and that's actually for the physical therapy room and they said they won't be able to bring those down for me. So my nurse that I had, she told me to wait till she come back on Tuesday and she'll buy me a mat. So I will be waiting till Tuesday. So, and today is Saturday, Saturday morning, uh, July 20th. So Tuesday will be day one, hopefully, of me doing yoga and stuff like that. And today I'm gonna do a separate video of the activities I do in my worker's corner. And that's usually my Bible, me reading my millionaire success and all that stuff. I'm gonna record all that stuff on a different video. So it's going to be more about my religion and actually spirituality and I'll get all into that once I record that video. But these daily vlogs are just like my everyday day, what I'm doing like in the room and stuff like that. That's why if you would have watched my other first video that was just welcome, welcoming me and introducing and my situation, then the next video was like my all day, what I did all day, who came in to see me, what I had to do and stuff like that and my calendar and all that good stuff and what I ate. But today I'll be adding in this video, my bathroom routine, and then in a separate video, my my workers corner. And so far they just have me like, what I can do is walk around the hallway. I did put that in there when the physical therapist came and she wanted to see how I walked. Then she asked me, did I want to use this chair here? I might get on there in a little bit, but once my levels go down, I won't be able to use that either because I get bruised. I will get bruised easily. But good morning. And if I decide on, I'm going to get up now and do my my bible and all that stuff and look at my menu and see what i can't eat this morning it's around 8 35 this morning they opened up at seven i gave them a call so they'll be calling me back shortly then i'll decide if i'm going to eat the cereal or whatever i see that's in the in a diet form that i can't eat so see y'all in a little bit looking over this nope in my diet and they have nothing on here that i want to eat so this is going to be a little hard. So for now, I guess you guys will just see what I end up getting in the morning this morning. And I guess this tells you why I have to eat out of this menu. But we'll see in a little bit. Um, continue with my workers' corner. This is in my workers' corner because I have to breathe on this um, 10 times a day. It's to help with my lungs and stuff because my lungs can clap. So basically... Sorry, my mom called my son done made a mess i'll put a picture up when i facetime him and stuff but this is what's gonna happen i gotta breathe in 
I gotta keep this little thing blue thing between these arrows and see how high I can get it over here. But I usually only get it up to the, I got it up to between the 2000 and the 50, 150, the 1500, but the second time I only went up to 1000. But yeah, that for now. See you guys in a little bit. Well, I was just doing my corner, my work corner. I was just doing my religious spiel, but she brought in my breakfast. And I ended up, oh, it fell. I love poppy seed bagels, so I got me a poppy seed bagel, toast, and two boiled eggs with jelly, salt, and pepper, almond milk, and orange juice. Alrighty, I'm laying down. I'm starting to feel a little nauseous after I just ate my breakfast. The nurse just left because my chemo, my first bag, is done. So she's going to go get me some nausea medicine, and then she's going to hang up my second bag of chemo. She told me I could record, but she said don't get her big booty Judy in the video. So I'm going to do the best I can and record as much as I can. And this is just for my second day. Well, it's technically my third day. My first day, I was only here from like 3 o'clock, and I did get a chemo that day. But yesterday was my full day. So when she gets back, I'm going to just record her hanging it up and giving me my nausea medicine. I know that's not what I wanted to eat. I wasn't going to eat any meat, and eggs are basically uh, meat, but I didn't want to just eat bread for breakfast, so I ate the two little boiled eggs. I didn't eat all the toast, and I ate my little muffin, and I drank all my ju orange juice, and I really didn't drink the, al drink the almond juice because my straw fell on the floor, and I didn't feel like getting up. And I just got done recording my religious work corner, so I'm going to put that up too. But until she comes back, see you guys in a minute. Just had to press record because I thought I was cute in this angle. Mm -hmm. Hey, you're giving it to me through the IV? Yeah. Okay. I know. Yeah. Could you give me Benadryl too? No? Okay. Okay. I went to go get somebody because they have to have like two people to read off the chemo, my name badge and all that to make sure that I'm getting the right chemo and it's going to the right person. I'm not going to record that because I don't want you guys knowing all my information. Not the chemo or anything, but like my birthday and my name and my account number or whatever that's called, my medical record number. So after they confirm all that, then I'll record her just hanging it up and stuff like that. So until that time comes. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't put your face. You told me you didn't want it. Yeah. In camera. You're beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah. She just told me that this chemo is going to run for like two hours and then I'll get up and go shower and do all that stuff that I do in the bathroom. But for now, I think I'm going to just take a nap and let my phone charge for these two hours. And I forgot to show you that I have to wrap my arm up to take a shower so that my tubes and stuff don't get wet. So this red light is just to give me some heat. So I'm going to take a shower 
and get myself together. I'm gonna, um, I just took a couple pictures of everything that I'm using. I'm not gonna actually record everything, like me brushing my teeth and taking a shower and oiling up. So I just took a picture of everything I used, like the soap, the toothpaste, and all that type of stuff in my oil. So when I'm all done. I'm in the shower. They always remake my bed and give me new sheets and stuff. That's my dirty, uh, what's it called? But I just wanted to show y'all. I supposed to use those green sponges to like brush my teeth and I just put it up here then I gargle with that. Then when I'm done brushing my teeth, I gargle with this and then I'll be done. But I brushed my teeth regular this morning. This is just like a rinse and then later I'll, since she already mixed some salt and baking soda for me in this bottle, I just shake it up a little bit and then I'll rinse with that later. But, and then that was, I took a picture of this and it's basically, I forgot to brush my teeth at night, but I will today. And then this is just the instructions on how to do it. Say when I oil up, I don't dry off. I like to oil up while I'm still wet so it can soak in some of the moisture and then I just black myself dry. My hair is still wet because I don't dry that. I like that to stay too. And then I'll call them to cut this off when I'm done to make sure everything under there is dry. She just bought my food up. I got orange juice. I am going to cheat. She brought bringing me a Sprite. Um, Should have opened it first before I started recording. But basically I got all the peppers, red, green, orange, broccoli, mushrooms, zucchini, onions. Hold on a second. Oh yeah, then they asked me that I want rice or anything, so a healthier way was quinoa. So I got quinoa stir fried. Hopefully it's good. Okay, I'm cheating for dinner because I told them that I wanted my dinner around 5 o'clock. And they didn't even start making my greens, so I ordered a burger and some fries. And I'll eat my greens around 7 o'clock. I have a visitor. She went to go get a mask because I technically supposed to wear the mask. But I don't feel like it, so I make the people that come in wear the mask. So hopefully she come back in a couple seconds. And I record coming in. She my cousin. Mm -hmm. I just recorded you on my video. On your Try to relax, okay? Inhale, exhale. Like that. Relax, inhale, exhale. Relax, okay. Inhale, exhale. Okay? Mm -hmm. So the videos are just the pictures and stuff. Which I'm just recording. Oh. <laughs> Basically just giving me my night medicines before I go to bed and then I got chemo at 9 o'clock at night and then 11 o'clock at night. And then I'll take a picture of my morning meds. But that would just be my day for the day. I read a little bit more of my millionaire success habits after my cousin left. Read the first two chapters. I'll read two more chapters tomorrow. And I'll do a video on that and stuff tomorrow so good night see y'all later basically the picture of the burger i had i didn't eat it all i only was able to eat half of it so i just showed that i didn't finish i just basically tasted it then later on that night like around eight o'clock it's about 8 40 something right now about to be nine o'clock i had ate the greens and it was pretty good so next time i know that i don't need to cheat and eat the meat and the ice cream and all that just stick with my greens and stir fry and 
yeah tomorrow you guys will see my medicine and stuff like that I might just record my success habits I'm gonna do two days of Bible in one and then two days of the reading in another video so every other day you'll get a video of my spiritual corner and then my my success habits so those will be two days in each video but I am going to continue to do my everyday vlogs of my day at the cancer center so I hope you guys enjoyed and I can see you guys in the morning they have this mic <laughs> I'm not in <laughs> sorry it's okay. just kidding <laughs> They're just preparing me for oh. my chemo. Okay. Get this neck on. You hung the chemo already or not yet? I am. Yeah. Okay. This, this one is the flush. Okay. To flush your line. This is for two hours, okay? Okay. So after this one, you get another one. What's that one? Steroid. A pre med for the chemo. Okay. I was up at like four in the morning. They took my weight and draw blood. They took your weight? Mm hmm. I weigh 177 now. Your weight's gonna fluctuate while you're in and out just because of the chemo, the amount of fluids and thing. Good morning. I look all swollen. I woke up with a headache. It basically, just gave me all my morning medicines to get me ready to take chemo. My hair hurts, so she just ran out to go get me my medicine. Yeah, not feeling so good today. My stomach hurt, I'm nauseous. I think I'm gonna just eat a muffin this morning. That's about it. Mm. Don't wanna get up, it's eight something, 8.30 I think. Like I said in my other video, I was up at like four in the morning to use the bathroom and they heard me. So they rushed in and made me do all the stuff that I wouldn't get up to do yesterday, like weigh me and blood pressure and all that stuff. So it's time for my late night chemo. I was tired. But Hopefully the day goes a little smoother. I don't feel so good already. This is day four. Negative. Day negative three. Hope you guys enjoy. I'm not enjoying it. I'm ready to go now. I'm so tired. And this is going to be four long weeks of doing the same stuff. I'm not up for it. See you guys later. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'm so here,
All right, this is our girl, Fraser Crawford, medical number 1025, 1665, 166, it's the top of the sign that goes first, it's 380, it's the goal over two hours, and it expires tonight. Don't worry, it's still the night anyway. I know, but it's the night. Do You don't give your family your work number? Well, no, I'm just saying, yeah, we're busy because we got outpatients too. You're not a, are they allowed to call your work? Yeah, and I just call them back. My mom's in rehab, my mom got sick and was in the hospital for a month. Mm -hmm. And my boyfriend's trying to go get her a new phone. They lost your phone. The hospital, mm -hmm. they're like, supposed to replace it. It was a hospital, but she's in rehab now. She's really, she's supposed to come home. How old is she? 74, but mm -hmm. my mom, she... my mom works out seven days a week and lifts weights. My mom volunteers no. at Halo mm -hmm. Homeless Shelter. My mom volunteers at Salvation Army. I walk a lot of circles, but this woman cannot walk you and me any day of the week. Mm -hmm. She is a go getter. So for her to be put down like this, yeah, she got busy with it right after her after she had pink, she didn't keep one, so I was she was so feisty, so I'm like, you know, I need to stop. Mm -hmm. No, I'm helping you out. I'm going to do something. How many brothers and sisters do you have? Huh? How many siblings do you have? I have one, and she lives, like, two hours away in central Wisconsin. Um, you're older, or is she? I'm older. I'm glad I have another brother and sister. Yeah. Well, that's it. My husband was 